Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a tutorial of how I curl my hair. First of all, I, I use this bioprogramming treatment device. You, you guys, this does not damage your hair whatsoever. So you could curl your hair endlessly every single day and it honestly helps your hair. It makes it healthier. When I use it, I feel like my hair gets shinier and smoother. And I used it for the last week of tour and I was like, oh my gosh, I wish I would have had it the entire tour. Drea gave me one and literally it is life changing and gives you the perfect curl while treating your hair at the same time. And that is just a huge thing for me because with short hair now, I wanted to style it almost every day. And when I use this, I have zero guilt because I know it's not damaging my hair. So I'm going to show you guys how I use it. And yeah, just give you a quick tutorial of how I curl my hair. First off, this is an inch size barrel. Um, I've used like an inch and a quarter before, but I always stick to the smaller barrels because I love when my curls kind of like look a little bit tighter and then they last longer and like tomorrow they'll look really good. So I take about like that size piece of hair. Um, I stick to the smaller pieces like towards the front of my face so they're more curled. But basically clamp goes forward. You slide it down, you roll it up. You want the clamp to be like either in the front or on the side here. You slightly pull and you roll up one more time. Hold there for a little bit. Then you pull and then you start twisting. So you pull this through, make a little twist and then pull. Twist, then pull, twist, and then you release and make it go straight at the end. So just like that, you leave it like that. Don't touch it, just leave it there. They might look a little ski womp <laughs> at times, but I promise you they turn out really well. Also, when I curl, I don't section off. I just like, I'll do a bottom piece like this and then I'll do a top piece just because my hair is like averagely fit, thick. I can't just like do one piece layers, you know, if that makes sense. So I just have to like double it up. And another thing I do that is probably something you have heard a lot of times is curling away from your face. So I'll split my hair in half and I'll do one whole side like this way and then one whole side that way. Then some people will be like, then how does the back look? Like, does the back look insane? No, it actually mixes pretty well together. I'll show you guys at the end. <laughs> this whole half of my head is done. Now I'm gonna move to this side and I'm gonna curl away from my face and I'm gonna start at the back this time. I put it at like 320 heat when I'm just like doing my hair for day to day, but like when I was doing shows and I needed my curls to like last the whole show, I would do like 360 degrees for the heat. But again, it does not damage my hair. So it's just wild. The science is crazy. <laughs> last piece. Okay, now I just let these curls cool down for like five minutes, I'd say. Like I just maybe clean up my bathroom a little bit, let it sit for a second, and then I'll show you what I do next. For day to day, I don't do much hairspray, but I'll just do a light little swipe. Maybe to some of you that's a lot of hairspray. Then I'll take a comb. This is my Dyson comb. You can literally, you can use your fingers to brush through them. You can use an actual brush. I just feel like using a comb today. So I go on the side that I first curled because that's probably like the one that's most ready. I mean, look at these curls, they're so cute. I think they're so cute. They're like beach wavy, but like still just like really pretty curls. I'll go upside down. I'll get some hair oil on the ends. And then that is how I do my curls. I think they're super cute. I feel like they are very like beachy and just like fun. But yeah, that's how I do it. I do it with the best treatment device ever. You guys need to get your hands on one of these.